Hey everybody, welcome to this episode of In the Kitchen, bringing great coffee home to you. I am the Kitchen Barista. Today we have a very special guest with us. What's your name? Catherine. Catherine. Catherine is going to help us answer the age-old question, what exactly is inside a K-cup? Now for those of you who may be unfamiliar with what a K-cup is, although I find that hard to believe these days they're everywhere, a K-cup is the little cups of coffee that go into a machine like this built by Keurig or uh, Breville has one that you can use them into, they make especially for the K-cup. What it is, it's, it's a cup that goes right in here, this is your K-cup, it goes in, shut it, you hit the brew button and it brews your cup of coffee right here. So we're actually going to answer the question, what is inside one of those? We've already brewed our coffee. Mm. Ah, it's good coffee. We've already brewed it because this Keurig brews it at 192 degrees, which means what, right after it brews, this cake cup is kind of warm and hot, so we want to let it cool down. So it's been brewed, and so now we're going to find out what exactly is in this with Catherine's help. So Catherine, what do you think is in it? You think there's coffee in it? No. How can it be that there, there has to be coffee in it? <laughs> it's coffee. So what do you think is in it? Coffee. And that's it? You just think there's coffee in it? And beans. And well, yeah, the beans will be ground, that's coffee. Alright? Well let's open it up and see what's in there. Ready? Have you ever dissected anything? No. At school? Okay, careful. No, not through around the edges. Ah, just kidding. Okay, ready? Peeling it back, what's in this? Well, Catherine, we said what's in it? Catherine said coffee. So I see coffee in here. Plenty of coffee in here. So now we're going to find out what's actually in here besides coffee, if anything else. This was a double bold or a bold coffee, so there'd be a lot in there. Anyone anyway, scrape it out? I see something else in there that's crucial. Oh, oh, I think you found it. What actually is crucial to coffee? When we put it in our brewer, what do we put in first? What's that piece of paper called we put in first? Starts with an F. Coffee. This piece of paper goes in and then the beans go on it, the ground. Starts with an F. Filter? Yes, okay, filter. So, ready? I think Catherine found the filter. Okay, so all the coffee is out. There's something along the sides of the, the K cup here. Get it out. This filter, it's right attached to the wall so it doesn't come out during brew, which is why it's so hard for me to get out. But I think we're getting it. And the K-cup is empty. It's got some loose ground still in there, but that's it. So what do we have? We've answered it. We've done it. Answered the question. What is in a K-cup? It's a... Filter. And... Coffee. Coffee. Beans. Grounds. They've already been ground, so they're grounds. Those are beans, right? So, there you go. That's what does the magic of it. Pushes straight through, pushes grounds through the filter, into the cup for a great cup of coffee. There we have it. You've answered the age-old question, Catherine. That's it for this episode of In the Kitchen. Now hopefully next time you have a cake cup, you'll, you'll know what's in it. Or maybe you'll be um, inspired to open it up yourself and you can find out exactly what's in it. But it does get kind of messy. So until next time, we will see you on the next episode of... Of what? Of In the Kitchen. In the Kitchen. So long.